Hey YouTube, it is Easy Prepper 101, and today we have the first alert fire extinguisher. And I saw a video a long time ago, and it talked about fire extinguishers, and that, yeah, you should have them in your house, like in your kitchen, in the garage and stuff. But the one thing he talked about is that you want to have one of these is in your bedroom. And he talked about how if you, if you live in a two-story or even ground level, you should still have a fire extinguisher. And he made sense to where... If you're in a fire and it's already raising up and if you want to try to delay to maybe before the fire department can come and help you or you can give your your loved ones time to get out, having a fire extinguisher in your bedroom is something you want to have. And I picked this up at Costco and it was on sale. It was actually the last one. I wish they had more. But these are normally like $35 to $37, and I got it for $24.95. So, you know, it's a $10 difference in that. Um, I have I have uh, another one like this uh, kind of downstairs in the kitchen, and I have another one. I have a smaller one in the garage, and I have some other smaller ones in the garage. But I wanted to get one in the bedroom, you know, for multiple reasons. One, for, God forbid, there is a fire in your house. You have this so you can get you and your loved ones out of the house. Second of all, you can kind of prolong it, like I just said, for the fire department to come. But another reason why it's kind of good to have this is you can use this to protect yourself from an intruder. If someone breaks into your house and if you don't have guns or you don't believe in guns, and which is totally fine, then having a fire extinguisher like this can also help to deter them if they come into your house. Pretty much what you would use this for is wait for them to come in in your bedroom, lock them up in your closet, be a little hidden so as soon as they come in, you already have the pin pulled. You can spray them in the face. Then you can pretty much use the rest of the base to knock them over the head until the police come or whatever. So that's another good deterrent to have a fire extinguisher in their house. There's also other stuff we can talk about that you maybe would want to have in your room. But this video, we're talking about this fire extinguisher. And right now, I'm going to turn it. Um, as you can see in here, it kind of tells you, you know, where you kind of want to have carbon monoxide detectors, smoke detectors, and where you're going to want to put fire extinguishers. And it kind of tells you first the instructions. First, call 911, pull the pin, uh, extend the hose, uh, and you'll pull the lever and engage until you can kind of get the fire out. So now what we're going to do is we're going to pull this out of the box. And literally for, for $24.95, I wish they had more. I think they might be getting another run on them, but I think if they do, they will they will be at the full price because it was a sale price. I asked one of the people who were working, and they said that they don't know if they're going to get anything more. So as you can see, it's just straight you know, out of the package. We'll be careful pulling this out. So it uh, has instructions, you know, the user manual talks about also how you can kind of hang it so you can kind of get the idea because it has the backing here that you can then use this to drill into your wall wherever you'd want to go to have this hang so then once you do is then you could use the clamp here to pull it off and then you can go ahead and use it so it's real great that they're giving you everything but the screws but I think for that you're going to want to, you want to have the screws that you want to have to put this into the wall and make sure when you do put something like this heavy you want to make sure you're hitting the stud so but um you know for this i really think this is a you know for, for 24 you know 25 bucks is a really good thing to have in your house uh definitely once i when I, once I saw that video it just was like almost like a light bulb like an aha moment in that so uh there's other stuff out there that they have um i've been trying to see uh they have like the little fire Looks like a little mini softball, whatever you could have, and you could throw it, and it just takes out the fire in that. And I know those are really expensive, over 100 to 150 in some cases in that. But right now, to have one of these in your in your bedroom, which is where this is going, is definitely something I'm gonna you know have, and it's something I make a suggestion that maybe put one in your bedroom besides having it in your basement because it might be able to save your life more than one ways, like I just like I just explained in this video. So. Um, that's going to be it for this video. Hopefully this video will help you guys, you know, if you're into prepping or even if you're not into prepping, if you're just kind of looking at fire extinguishers, you know, what, what would be a good one, whatever, this would be a good one. I'm not going to pull the pin and use this as a demo because I'm going to use this for an emergency situation. 
Um, we, I did find uh, some smaller ones that I found um, at a uh, hardware store that I'm going to do a demo on on those to see if those are good because I got those pretty cheap. But for this, for the price of this, if you have a Costco membership and if the deal is still going on, to grab one for the $24.95 or $97. Um, it's, it's just a really good price and a good thing to have when it's in your house. Write in the comments section down below if you guys actually have some type of fire extinguisher or something to help, you know, put out a fire, you know, besides having like a ladder if you live in a two-story house. So let me know if you guys have one, a fire extinguisher in your bedroom. So just, you know, I would like to kind of know from everyone out there. Um, hit the thumbs up if you like this video. And if you haven't, please hit that subscribe button. Thank you guys so much. And we will catch you guys down the road.